Yo, what's going on? Today we're back in the video. Today we're back inside of Roblox My Restaurant for a brand new video. Before we start this video, I just wanted to say that only 5.9% of everybody who watched my channel is subscribed. So if you guys are not subscribed, please go down below and hit the subscribe button. I would very, very, very much appreciate it. And while you guys are down there, please hit the like button after you guys subscribe. Hit the post bell for notifications so you never miss a video or stream that I do. So with all that said, enjoy the video. And inside of this video, I will be showing you guys B2's latest layout. Sorry guys, <laughs> starting a little bit, but latest layout and the first floor is on the left side of the screen and everything that you need is going to be on the left side of the screen. And you guys do need corrupted royal or royal tables for this layout to work properly. So let's just get right into it. So obviously this is a bigger restaurant layout as it says i think i don't think it says it actually now i'm thinking about it um but you do need bigger restaurant layout for this but it is the best layout that ha that's currently released on roblox my restaurant so let's just get right into this so first of all you do need uh some luxury dishwashers you know right here and then we're gonna start with you know three little golden uh order stands and we're gonna have three stoves right there and then we're gonna have you know uh, five more stoves right there and then we're gonna switch it over and we're going to have a coffee machine and then when we come to this side it's basically just the same thing so we're gonna start in the back side now and we're gonna work our way up and then right here is going to be one luxury stove and then the rest of this right here is gonna be the white carpet is open so that your um workers can you know walk through here and everything like that so now we're gonna start with the tables we're gonna come one block off you know we're gonna have it diagonal or vertical i think and this is diagonal now and then we have two more vertical you know just just follow you know what is on the screen you know you know we're gonna have our chairs placed you know just right here don't you know don't follow what i did over here yet you know just to make it easier on you guys do not follow what i did over here yet you know just continue doing what i'm doing over here and then we're gonna come down we have a table you know that's on this table the end of it and then the end of the this table is gonna be on this chair and you're gonna come down two and then you're gonna place four chairs you know, and then you're gonna place a christmas tree and you guys do need a Christmas tree for this layout or else it will not work properly. Um, or you do not actually need it. As I'm thinking right now, you don't really need it. You can just place four fillers in. But if you need it, or but not need it, but if you guys have it, I recommend that you definitely place it down or that you guys definitely get one to make the prop, to make the maximum 300 mil an hour if you guys have all 10 floors. So now we're going to have Christmas tree right there. There I have two more chairs. You know, then we're gonna place uh, or one more time chairs. Two more tables. Then we're gonna place chairs around that. This right here is gonna be a gap from this chair to this chair. We're gonna have a table right here. We're gonna place the chair on both ends of it, and then two chairs facing the back wall. You know, and then right here, two chairs facing front wall, table, and two chairs facing back wall. And then it's gonna be empty spaces. And then we're just going to have, you know, some decor right here or fillers. And then we're going to have two vertical tables. And then we're just going to have four chairs on each side. And that is going to be it for this area right here. And then the rest of it, which is black, as you guys obviously can tell, this is going to be the core. And we are done with floor one. Now we're going to move from floor two. And I'm only going to do floor two because I already have everything up and running on every other floor up to five. Now I'm working on getting floor six in here. But, you know, so floor number two, just to show you guys how you do it. So you're going to have four chairs, or four, I keep saying chairs, four tables facing the diagonal. You know, place chairs on them. And then when you're going to do, you're going to place, you know, two tables on each side. It's going to be it table on, on the last table you know extend it two out you know, table 
on this side and send the two out, you know, and just place two chairs on each side, you know, facing front and back wall. You know, this would be front wall, this would be back wall. And then you have an open gap right here. And then on both sides, you are going to want to place this, the coffee machine. I'm going to face it going forward right here. And then there's going to be a Christmas tree, as you guys can obviously tell. You know, white is empty. And then back here, again, is going to be two coffee machines. We're going to face it like this, and then like that. And then back here is going to be the same as the front um, front layer right there of chairs and tables. Ooh, I put that the wrong way. So we're just going to have it like this. And then that is pretty much it for that. And then the rest of this floor is just going to be the core or whatever you guys want to put on it. With all that said, I will see you all in the next one.